In the 75th anniversary of Galgariba Arena, the Cowboys have potentially their best team since the 2004 Final Four squad, which featured six future NBA players. This year's team could be just as talented, and expectations are at an all-time high. I'm a Cowboy in heart, so looks like I'm coming back for my sophomore year. <laughs> With the decision of Marcus Smart, Markel Brown, and LeBron Nash to return for one more year, OSU became one of the favorites to play for the national title this season. The Cowboys have their highest preseason ranking since 2004, when they were ranked 8th before going on to the Final Four that year. The high ranking has given the players something they haven't experienced before, high expectations. Well, it's definitely new, uh, having high expectations like that. We just kind of put that on the back burner. Uh, we know we can be a great team, but we just have to uh, do everything we have to do to get there. The Cowboys will look to improve on last year's success when they went 24-9 and finished third in the Big 12. They can't end the season like last year, though, a disappointing first-round loss to Oregon in the NCAA tournament. None of us finished the way that we wanted to last year, and we kind of want to continue with that and pick up where we left off and finish off strong this year. To help the returning players, the Cowboys have signed a great recruiting class. Leighton Hammonds and Jackson Perez will provide depth at the guard position, while Gary Gaskins will get pivotal minutes in relieving Cobbins. The Cowboys also add Oklahoma High School Player of the Year Stevie Clark, which just shows how the basketball program has progressed the past few years. Uh, this program's been on a rise since I've been here, and uh, being able to be preseason ranked for my senior year, my last year, uh, it's just it says a lot about this program and where it's headed. The non-conference schedule should provide some early challenges for this team. The Cowboys host a top 15 Memphis program before heading to Florida for the Old Spice Classic, where they could face Memphis again in the championship game. There is also a home game against South Carolina and a game in Las Vegas against Colorado, who will likely be ranked heading into that game. OSU will host Robert Morris on New Year's Eve before opening conference play. The Cowboys will be looking for their first Big 12 championship since the 2005 conference tournament. Succeed there and they will make a run for their seventh Final Four appearance, and possibly their first national title since 1946. For Orange Nation Sports, I'm Aaron Schnauz.